So you decided to buy a house, but you're not sure who to call, where to start, or even what questions to ask. That's why I'm here to help you. I am Brickell Corcoran with Keller Williams Realty here in Yuma, and I'm a military spouse realtor dedicated to serving families like you. So whether you're local or PCSing across the country, I am here to help you with any of your real estate needs. And in this video, I'm going to be chatting about what is a buyer consult, why do you need one, and what is it all about? So here we go. All right, so what is a buyer consult and why do you need one? When you are first deciding to buy a house, it is important to meet with a real estate professional to figure out the process, what are the first steps, what do you need to do, and that's what a buyer consult is, and I'm gonna tell you in this video what we accomplish in a buyer consult. So if you're local or PCSing across the country, we meet either in person or via Zoom, and I walk you through the steps of how to buy a house. In that conversation, here are five things that I tell you for the process of buying a house. Number one is getting in touch with a lender. I highly recommend using a local lender because oftentimes they have lower fees and competitive interest rates and they work around the clock and are available oftentimes by cell phone so they can answer your questions at basically any time of day. Um, number two is determining your budget. So a lot of buyers aren't sure how much they're looking to spend on a house, but rather they know the monthly payments that they can afford. And so my job is to figure out what is your monthly payment that you're looking to stick to. And then I will pull up a calculator and punch in some numbers based on um, average in interest rate, taxes and insurance. And then we can kind of go from there and determine the cost of the house, figure out your price range, your budget, and the third thing, and this is really fun, is what are you looking for in a house? The fun stuff. Um, are you looking for a two-car garage or a three-car garage? How many bedrooms do you want? Um, do you want a pool or no pool? Do you want to be in town or in the foothills or in a different location? Those are the kinds of questions that I'm gonna ask you in even more detail to figure out what it is you are really looking for in a home and hone in on your needs and your wants. Number four is I walk you through the process of what it looks like when we go under contract all the way to closing. So I will let you know how much money you can be expecting to spend up front. What is a general home inspection? What are closing costs? And what does the seller typically pay for for closing costs? All of those things, I'm gonna break those down for you so you can kind of get a brief idea of what to expect. And the fifth thing is that I will then set you up on a search so you can start looking at listings. The search that I set you up on is linked to our local MLS. So it is the most up-to-date website, Zillow and Realtor.com, and those websites are typically not up-to-date. And so I highly recommend using the website that I set you up on. It's called the Collaboration Center, and it's super neat because I can actually log on to your dashboard and I can see houses that you favorite or reject or question. You can even set up showings within the website, and so it's super neat, super collaborative, and it basically helps us work together as a team to find you a house. That's what a buyer console is. It's super simple, and it's really fun, too. I get to know a little bit about you and your needs for buying a house and answer any questions that you have um, before we get the process of going. That's it. So if you're looking to buy or sell in Yuma, I'm your girl, just give me a call or shoot me an email. I'd be happy to set up an appointment with you and meet with you and chat about how I can help you meet your real estate goals. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.